Hey y'all. So, um, like I stated on my other post, I said I was going to share for the first time on this platform um, when my innocence was taken from me. I'm using filter words for TikTok as I don't want um, my page to get flagged or anything. Um, so I'm going to make it short. I have to make it short because it's only three minutes long. Um, so yeah, so here it goes. So I had a classmate. And I was, like I said, I was six years old. And um, my mom was very particular about meeting parents. She didn't let me go over everybody's house. So she had already met them. The father was a pastor, the mother was a first lady. So she would allow me to go over and spend the night. Well, this particular weekend, we I went to spend the night. And then the next day we went to church. And then after church, we went to their grandmother's house. Uh, so uh, it was me, my classmate, one of her younger sisters, and a cousin, and we were down in the grandmother's basement. And um, my 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 friend and her her sister went upstairs for some reason. I can't remember what happened, but it, we ended up being I ended up being by myself with the male cousin, um, who's just a year older than us. Um, he began to ask me questions. He took he he I believe he asked me to go outside for some reason. I'm remembering the balcony. But um, he began to ask me questions um, that were inappropriate for a six-year-old. And then he started touching my leg. And then after the leg, he started touching um, trigger warning. I should have put that at the beginning of the trigger, tr trigger warning. Um, he started touching um, other areas, that uh, private areas, that only my mommy had access to at the time. Now, even at six years old, I had seen movies and things of that nature um, but they were always adults. And so I'm trying to figure out why is this happening to me at six years old? What did I do to um, invite this? You know, even at six, this is all the things that are going in my head. What is going on? What, why is he touching me like this? And I just had this overwhelming sense of, it was like terror almost, you know. Um, you, ever, you know how when somebody sneaks up on you and say boo or something like that and you, your heart dropped? That's how I felt at that moment, but it wouldn't go away. Um, and so that was the first time that my innocence was taken from me. And one of the reasons why I'm doing this, y'all, because, and I promise you I'm giving the short version, is because a lot of you are holding on to things from the past that happened. You are holding on to trauma, and you have got to release it. It was not your fault. You, it was nothing that you did to ask for. It, it was nothing that you did to bring it to you. And I encourage you to talk to God and then talk to somebody like a therapist or somebody to help you get through it. Understand you are loved. God loves you and I love you. Release that thing.